Hello again, folks, and welcome back to Let's Play Lunacid. I'm your game master, Darius. I more or less retraced all my steps, except I had uh, found out two things. One, well, three things. One, I don't want to go down there. That'd be a dumb idea. Uh, two, I have not been, <laughs> strangely enough, uh, bleeding on a bunch of plants is not quite enough. You just need to bleed some more on top of them. And I also found a little journal that was all like, hey, you gotta, you gotta bleed a lot and some of them will have corpses in them. Uh, three, there's his vine here. Gotta, gotta be careful not to push yourself off the vine. I don't know where this is going. And I'm really hoping that I don't fall. I did level up a little bit, but I don't think I would have leveled up, 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 up any more than I had. Oh, hey. I, again, creepy ass door. Here I was kind of thinking we were done with this enchanted key. Uh, let's see, enchanted key. Wait. Oh, I need to buy another enchanted key, don't I? Buy or find one. Hmm. I won't lie, this little this little thing seems suspicious. Ugh. There's a very green greeniness. Alright, well, I'm going to have to find a, find or purchase another enchanted key. That's good to know. Um, does look like it's branching out ah, to other branches. I just don't know whether or not... And if it's going to lead anywhere, or if I'm just essentially waiting to fall to my death. Waiting to fall to my death it is. Oh, uh, yep. Oh, hey, I didn't die. I regret it, but I didn't die. <laughs> Anyways. Uh, somewhat retracing my steps here. Because I don't want to just go and get the, uh... Just teleport myself back to the place, get myself a key, and go there just yet. Because I had found, uh, the, the little plant that had the blood in front of it, I had quickly experimented with it with the blood drain, and apparently it was several uses of the blood drain. That made it so as it actually, you know, did the thing. So now I gotta find the other ones. And do that. By the way, this empty, this forest is now empty. No treasure. This forest is now empty. Uh, because I haven't yet to respawn the monsters within it. Wait, have I found the rusted sword before and I'm just acting surprised like an idiot? Pretty sure I had. Rusted sword. Rusted discarded a great sword. The rust of lo the level of rust almost seems unnatural as if the metal itself held strange oils. Yep. Now for a rusty greatsword, it swings pretty well. I'll give it that. <clears throat> I don't remember what this turned into. That's the thing, too. Oh, also. Yeah, this is what happened when, uh... 
this vine had grown out of here and leads right back to here. Freaking, freaking love it. I uh, can't level up just yet. And again, just because you hit the gym does not make everything respawn, which is uh, somewhat think of a godsend. Alright, now I'm just trying to think of ways to go that aren't this way. Because this does... I, I did get all the way back through here. You provide nothing. Bastage. But I did get all the way back through here. Open up, open up the shortcut to get to this side of the thing. Now I gotta re-equip my torch. Never mind, no I don't. I might just try to use my rusted sword to get through some more of this more of the chunk of this area. Oh, also, I did have the 50. If you'd like, I have some items for you. I did have the 50. I bought the thing instead. I've yet to use it because I can use that to also restore my magic. Now I just need to remember which way I was going. Gotta love this music, man. I don't know. Gets in the ear, stays in there for a while. Let's see, that led up. This was nothing. And that was this. Okay. I don't remember where I've been yet. <laughs> there was one... One of those little bulbs that I had yet popped. For the sheer purpose of going, ah yes, I had not yet been that way. Because I knew the second that I was going to pop it, uh, I was going to forget that it was the direction I've already gone. Or not yet gone. something though okay that's more or less the beginning of the game again or not the game but you know what I mean and where the hell was it is this lies this is just leading back up to patchouli isn't it Yes? Man, this is the downside of a game not leaving a bunch of corpses in, it, in your wake. Was it this way to patchouli or was it the other way? Okay, that way to patchouli. Which means I'm pretty sure that I left... The remaining bulb dude. No, no. This was the way to darkness. Uh, I mean, I saved. Fine. Fine. I forget the name of the freaking Cthulian horror thing that it is, but the... If I remember correctly, which I probably don't, uh, with this area, you light the three furnaces and the invisible creatures that are, you know, invisible, will suddenly become visible. Really. I have regrets. I have regrets. 
if there is one thing that makes me not want to play this game, it's this area. Yeah, I hear you. Now I feel like I got a serpentine just to avoid any possible attacks that they may throw at me. You can attack them while they are invisible. The problem is they are invisible. They're also rather strong. I I want to say that it is very bad that I decided to come here, period. Peasant graves, color crypts. This way is the way out. Yep. Thing is, though, I don't even remember the invisible creatures being all that bad once I actually figured out what they were. Just a matter of, you know, finding them. Which you can usually do by simply running into them. There's three fires you had to lit. Noble crypts. Had to lit, had to light. Oh. Migo, that was it. And yeah, you can kill them slowly. As far as I remember, they're worth quite a bit of experience. You can only barely see them uh, through other light sources. I'm, I'm still not sure why the hell I'm still here. I think maybe I'm thinking to myself, hey, if I kill Amigo, I can get quite a bit of experience points. And I can. It's just, you know, not wise to linger. At the least, though, I'm not. I'm deciding not to go down into the crypts. <sighs> I'm very much. Was that here? I will fight you, Miko. I got the magics. God, this is torture. This is torment. I just want to leave. I probably could if I can get up this. Hit. Hit. Hurt. Maybe if I jump from this. I need to up my deck some more. Which that Migo gave me pitiful experience. Yeah, I think it's I think it's wiser to just kinda go whoop out of here. Been a while since I've been to Wings Rest in the first place, so. What's up? Hi Aaron. Found this and I made me think of you. Oh! Hope you're safe. Hope you're being safe on your way down. Remember, you can always come back here using the warp crystals. Sometimes it's good to take a break or even revisit an area you've already been to. Be safe. Hi. Uh, sadly, I don't have the money for trinkets. 
We should have enough mo uh, 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 enough materials to craft shit, though. Uh, wait, what was it? Opal Moral Lotus. Never mind, I don't have the shit for it. Snowflake Obsidian, Onyx, and Obsidian. Dang it. I got enough for throwing daggers. Known to cause delirium and death. So I'm gonna guess that not a whole lot of recipes are gonna just be three things. Although it does kind of... It does kind of seem to... guide you in a way. Uh, like if you just use obsidian, it will point out, oh hey, ashes have something in common with that. Well, I think the only other place I can currently go that won't immediately kill me Uh, wouldn't be the Yusei Forest, it would be back to the Hollow Basin, back to the bad place with a good foot. Just back this way? Yeah. Hello again, ladder. Where'd this way go again? Now this way was to the Yusei Forest. This way... Back to the... Silence Temple. I'll harm you! Yeah, we want to go back to the Silence Temple because there's the other path that leads through here. I'm given the sword experience points. Aha! I upped my defense this time, bitch! You know what? Saw to you. How much experience do I get for murdering this guy anyways? Eh, not bad. I think at some point I do just want to... ...spend a little bit of time doing little else besides leveling up my shite. Alright, now I'm just trying to remember where the other path was. Because if y'all recall... ...when I was trying to get through to the other path myself the first time... Hello? Ow. Here's me wishing I had more money. Relatable. Um... Okay. Hmm? Alright, I could jump back down here. Oh. God, that's so silly sometimes. Ah! Not enough to make it. It's fine. Oh. Alright, can I use this? No.
Ferga, burga, flurga. I think what it is is that I had to go to a particular place that I recall. That makes no sense, Tar. It does make sense, I assure you. Like, if I come back here... Back the way I came... And then... If I hang a Louie? And I kept hanging this Louie. Because I want to say that one of the things about this place is that it did not have a save gem. Yeah, I believe that this was the way out, out. Back to the place. The place? The place. Oh, hello, you. This is the right direction. There's a thing to read. There it is, the Fetid Mire. First though, we're gonna go this way. Because why not? Yep, this was one of the other... ...doors I could have taken. I'm still waiting for one of those dudes to simply just come alive. I love it when they actually move at me and it makes it for collecting their goodies all the easier. Yeah, I wasn't going to get any additional coin off these mummies. Or not coin, but weapon experience points. Let's see, was this one... Hmm. Irked that it's just a single solid room. Alright. So there... If I recall, there was a thing here during early access that you would hit later. But either it's not there anymore, or it needs to be revealed. That'll make more sense later on, I... ...totally promise. Whee! Now I'm just wishing I did up may upgrade my uh, speed stat. If only just to run to the fetid mire a lot faster. Okay, that was the pork list door. This one tells me the fetid mire. There should be a couple of more mummies and then there's... Pain. But before there's pain, there's one other thing I need to collect. Thank crap it, that music stopped. Here you are. Stone Club. Thanks, bruh. Stone Club. A simple club fashioned from stone, difficult to handle, but a viable option with rudimentary weapons are hard to come by. I did not actually equip it. Funny enough, not much worse. Not much, not much worse or better rather than the uh, rusted sword. Matter of fact, I think it's actually worse to use the rusted. Well, worse to use the club because it's slower for the same amount of damage. In this way, to the fetid mire. Ooh, 
lotus seed pods. We're finally in the finally in the money now, boys and girls. Cause I can use this in order to get my ass some more healing for not free. But just more healing in general. There's a shiny over there. Well, I say shiny, but it's literally just a thing telling me directions. Rest area and the lower passage. Let's let's use that rest area first. Rest area. Rest area. Hello, rest area. Bonk. Ah. Hey, I did have a level up. Alright. Uh, let's upgrade my deck some more. I'm just realizing I'm, this er this version of Errant is more or less turning into a Dragoon. And I'm alright with this. Now, I would say, hey, let's go and do the Fetid Mire, but no, we're not going to do the Fetid Mire just yet. Because I wanted to go back. E. I wanted to go back and do. Uh, see if I can't refine that goddamn. Ratty! Run, Ratty! Run! That's fine. Uh, yeah, go back into the. Temple of Silence. See if I can't find that dead end again. I swear that guy is following me. But yeah, I'll, I'll probably also off screen going a little bit in and out of this place, grind a little bit of those Lotus Sea pods. Just so as I can get myself some, some of that sweet, sweet healing items. But because I changed areas, the mummy should have returned. Should have. I'm not sure if they did. Yeah? Or maybe it's one of the... I'm not sure how the hell they might have done the, uh... The resting and respawning mechanics. Oh, there's one. Sorry, bruh. Alright, let's see if I can't find it really quickly, like. If I can, great. If not, balls. Okay. So that way is that. Was it this way? Yeah, that way is back to that. God damn it. Huh. I'd kill for a map. I really, really would. Because I think, don't quote me, ow, I think that I needed the iron, or either the stone or the metal club in order to bust down that wall. Uh, what walled are the one I'll, I'll, one I'll eventually find again? Ooh, good strike, good strike. Wait, where were you 
in here? Ah, oh, there you are. And... Really? Maybe it does need to be metal. God damn it. Well, uh, I think on that note, I'm going to go ahead and hide in this corner right around here and call an episode here. When we return, uh, I suppose I got to go down into the fetid mire. Not exactly my first choice, as that place kind of sucks. A lot of poison. A lot of, lot of poison, oozes, kind of stuff like that. Thank you everyone so very much for watching, and I hope to see you folks in the next video. Take care. Cheers.